Uh, how was the show for you? Hate it, love it. How was the show? Great. Don't lie. What'd you learn? Stop the cow. Nothing. It's just great. God didn't answer another oh, question. This, me a little this little show is good, good, and I learned what hit. Typical Russian did. female doesn't say much. <laughs> yeah, her country taught her well. That's what I learned. Wait, what'd you learn? What Hitler did. Oh, uh, well. Okay. Well, we're still on Rumble. Yeah, go for it. Well, you want to? You wanna... Well, I was gonna say what it really happened. But <laughs> you know what happens when you talk about the fucking Holocaust? Man, they, they don't mad. care, man. Who are you? Right. Yeah, they don't care. Um, I would say this was like honestly like really good. Um, I just think that everyone has a like you know statement to make. We all often are very much agreeing on the same thing, just adding a little two cents, and I think that is like what makes it a conversation. It was really good for me. So what do you switch? What? With Lizzo. <laughs> no, no, I wouldn't. I wouldn't. No. You're mean. What about you? <laughs> It was interesting, like hearing <laughs> okay. uh, different people's opinions. Facts. Um, What'd you learn? Oh, who said that? Like, <laughs> not really important to me. Nothing really important. I don't care. Cause no, I mean <laughs> they have different points, and it's okay. But I'm Colombian. I, I don't have the him. I don't have the same points as them. So. I'm better than y'all niggas. Okay, cool. Got no, it. Ah, that's typical. Uh, someone asked this question here. Do you feel like a man should stay after their girl cheats? Fuck no. She's <laughs> dead after that. Not dead, like really. Oh. But I mean, like you're you don't. That she man should never ever forgive a girl for cheating. Give us give us some in-depth reasons of why you why you said that. There might be some of them that question it. Why should you not give her a chance? Because she's women. You only have one job. Don't be a fucking slut. Mm. Mm. That's fair. Uh, uh, hold on. You know what? Let's make this fun. If me and you were out, and some guy came and fucking attacked you, and I just observed, would you break up with me? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Yes. Because it's my duty to protect you, right? Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Okay, oh, it's your duty to not be a that. slut. Oh, okay. There you go. Yeah. That's oh. why. Same shit. That same level of betrayal you feel <laughs> by me not protecting you, oh, not God. doing my job. Walked into that buzzsaw. <laughs> Easy, man. Because <laughs> <laughs> I find it hilarious how women will sit there and be like, well, you, know, you should accept me being a whore. And it's like, well, you would never accept me if I didn't defend you. Ooh. Who really says that? Though? At all. Huh? Who says what? Like, they say it indirectly. She literally just said a second ago. I had a woman and tell her, me. They made the argument. No, if you cheat on me, I should be able to cheat back. back. They literally just said that. Yeah, if somebody cheats first, you should be able to cheat back. No, no, but hold on. And then you should break up with me. Did you forget the doctor analogy I gave earlier? But what's the logic there? He cheated, so you want to cheat too? Yeah, what's the You didn't want to cheat in the first place. But now you did it. I mean, really, I would probably just leave, but... No, 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 you're going back to what I said at the beginning. Process. You're going back to what I said at the beginning. Yeah. If you are against this thing, you wouldn't do this in thing. The first to I'm just saying, just I understand. Leave. I understand. If you had a choice, yeah. you would cheat too. See, there's a problem with feminism. See, there's a problem. Women think that they're it's equal to men. That's why yeah. they say shit like that. Yeah. Let me be very clear with you guys. You guys are not equal to us at all. You guys suck at most things that humans do, if I'm going to be honest. You guys are weaker, shorter, smaller, dumber a lot of the times, if I'm going to be honest. Have too much emotions. You guys bleed a couple times a, uh, a month. Like, bro, y'all suck at everything. So I, I, men got to lead everything. I mean, call me an asshole, massage, whatever. And I just know what it is. But, but what you just said, you said, no you, if you said you? to them, if they watched her get her, if, if they watched, if your man watched you get your ass beat, would you stay with him? You said no. But if you watch me get my ass beat, I'm no. gonna say, "Bitch, you didn't help me." Why? She was just a girl. Oh, no, I said, I wouldn't tell you to run. If you was getting assaulted, if a guy was getting assaulted and he loves you, tell you run. Get out of there. If a bitch is hitting me, nigga, fight that bitch. Or if a nigga hitting me, hit that nigga. No, what we're saying is we're not gonna hold that against you because you didn't jump in the fray with us. It's a choice. Like, okay, you should not hold it against me. It's still different because you're not. When you're getting beat up or something, you're not moaning in their ear and showing the affection that you share with your boyfriend to someone else. And that's just so what? 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 <laughs> Boy, that what? Yes, it does. What? No, I get it. It Wait. makes plenty of sense yeah. because, yeah. like, if, if a guy cheats on you, we're not the same. If a guy cheats on you, now you have this girl moaning and just like everything you do to me, you're doing to her, and it's just like. I just... And when you cheat on me, you've been dominated by this other nigga. This nigga got your legs up by your ears. <laughs> no, this nigga's baby, drilling you. He's dropping. <laughs> Wait a minute, hold on. Let me tell you what he's doing. He's dropping some shit off in you. Maybe I'll. And then you that. come back to my house with this nigga shit in you. Oh my god. Brush. Ew. Well, is that not what happens? Mm. It's protected. What do you mean what happens? Who you put in a bar. He put his dick <laughs> in your mouth. The DNA. Hey, who said that was happening? In your little yeah, he friend, gotta too. Always say oh, so you, when you cheat, you be like, hey, look, 
It's just this like, it's like, like a low, 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 It'd be like at McDonald's. It's after 10 30. It's like, yeah, like, 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 I can't kiss you. I got a girlfriend. I can't kiss you. I got a girlfriend. I just don't know. Usually when you cheat with morals, they just like. I know wrong with that. When girls cheat, they just like. I got a man. Yeah, okay. Why you know that? Wait a minute. Why you know that? You know, I really respect that. Wait a minute. I respect that. He'd be like, I fuck your bitch. Yeah, she'd be like, but. I didn't suck your dick. <laughs> <laughs> That's my girl. That's my girl. Mm-hmm. Okay. Miss <laughs> Thomas, mm-hmm. what about you? What? Hold on, I got you. I got you. <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> Thoughts on the show. Hate it, love it. Hold the show for you. Okay, I like it. I'm just here. You like it? Was it was good. Yeah. yeah. You were very quiet. Oh, listen. And sweet. Yeah, you are. You are. You are nice. She's okay. Yeah. All right, what about you? I forgot she was um, Girls got to give each other the bullshit compliments. Yeah. It never fails. <laughs> it's and just, sweet. It just works. Um, honestly, I think everyone's very open-minded and everyone had their own opinions. Some opinions are the same as others. Is it a mic, please? Well, we stated uh, facts. You guys gave opinions, which a lot of them were wrong. Some opinions are the same as others, but honestly, That's I That's mean, why they're called opinions. opinions. <laughs> well, opinions could be wrong. And you think we say our facts all the but time. But they're my opinions. You were so basically not. stating facts. What was wrong? Nothing was wrong. I would just feel like... Uh, no, I Why you comment on the show? We're like Finch introducing things to a no, conversation a that have nothing problem. to do with it. Why are you even talking right no, now, No, it's nigga. a part of the problem. Y'all want only facts in the conversation. Y'all don't want people to add their hey, two Lizzo. cents. Hey, Hold on. Let me... Oh, hold on. Look, 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 look. look. See, that, that, look, look. Uh-huh. See, this is the difference between men and women, right? Like, you guys think everyone's voice matters, right? Yeah, I do. And I'm here to tell you, not everyone's voice matters. Because a lot of y'all say dumb shit. I think the smart people should speak, and the people that are more fact more factually and logically sound because the thing with women is that you guys think everyone's opinion matters and most importantly you guys think everybody's opinion is valid <clears throat> that's not the way that the world works that's just not how it goes but women think my opinion matters it's like well your opinion can also be wrong so but girls don't like hearing that bro that's like, why they came out with this term my truth yeah, yeah my truth because there's the truth yeah not your fucking truth and, I and women like... actually believe it. yes so and they always lead conversations with i feel i feel I when feel. you talked about facts you said you guys only want facts no opinion should be based on some facts true don't you build opinions off of facts yes for sure. example yeah. i'll tell you like if i say i think men need to lead in all relationships you might say well why do you say that myron well, well biologically speaking, the reason why I came up with that, you might think it's opinion, but it's based on fact. Women want leaders. They want a man that's stronger than them, makes more money than them, more status, etc. So by definition of what women want, the man needs to be the leader. That's how I came to that conclusion. I'm able to walk back what I said with some type of factual backing. You guys, on the other hand, well, we should be able to fuck niggas too. Yeah. Because Where does that come it. from? Because uh, I'm equal to men. Yeah. Are you really, though? Are you really equal to us? Like, you know, Bio- like biology, so biology well. wise, are you really equal to us? Yeah. No, you're not. you're not. And I described that with the whole doctor analogy. We What's only easier? That way and a lot of y'all stopped too. dealing with yeah. other females <laughs> because y'all felt she was disloyal. Literally, you be like, bitch, you was disloyal. It's hard to be your friend's friend when she fucked your man that she knew you loved, right? Yes. Yeah. Or left you at the club. Why is, why is that hard yes. to come back from? Yeah, because literally. it's the respect. It's, yes. it's honest. So that's what he's saying as a man. You had one damn job. I'm. Everybody's looking at me. Nobody respects me as a man when they know you step out. Okay. No one respects you. Me, Kobe Bryant cheated on, on Vanessa? What happened? They, what oh, happened? wow, she's a... Uh, it's Vanessa Bryant, right? Yeah, yeah. Vanessa yeah. Bryant. Yeah. Strong she cheated woman. on her back in 04, 05? Everyone, oh, wow, she's loyal. She stuck by him, etc. Will Smith's bitch? I don't even know her name. Jada, Jada? who cares? Jada. She cheats on him, career ruined. Thank yep. you. Lars Nobody has any respect for Will. Come on now. He's a running joke. I was going to say his career is ruined. No, no, we're not going to say his career is ruined. I'm asking. He's a running joke. No, no, though, his legacy is ruined. If you cheat Everybody on a man, makes fun of him. If you cheat on a man, Everybody you destroy his legacy. Him, like, if Nobody a man makes che- fun cheats of on you Bryant, and you stick to him, but they make fun you build of him. on that legacy. It's not People the same. People do clown her. What are you talking about? What did I say about Vanessa Bryant? If you're saying that someone got cheated on and they're sticking beside them, that's... That's not give me the who, who clowns Vanessa, Vanessa Bryant. I would be like, damn, bitch, cheat on you. You're missing the question. I keep asking I, the question. I, you go away. I said, who what clowns Spanish? Vanessa Bryant? That was a simple question. No. He's asking people in general. Do the same in general. Who? He's asking I for specifics. Now. I she, you see how she's answering the question? Bro. I would. Yeah, but I said, who? Who does it? Is currently now? Who's doing that? If it's brought up, I think it'll be talked about. Bro, bro, just no one. Uh, Vanessa Bryant is oh extremely God. respected. Her image yes. is not taking a hit whatsoever. She's a it's philanthropist. Christine. She's Miss Bryant, etc. 
Melania Trump, she's been cheated on a bunch. a bunch. But what is she, the first lady, they still respect her. Yeah, because yeah. women don't lose status when their man steps out on them. But the man absolutely loses status if his woman steps out on him. We're not yeah. the same, ladies. Hell, nobody talks shit about Jackie Kennedy. There That's you go. True. And JFK did nothing but cheat. Matter of fact, they idolized her. She yes. still there with the blood on her fucking dress as Lyndon B. Johnson took that oath. Man, this bitch is loyal. This nigga fuck Marilyn Monroe. Coretta Scott King. There. They got all them tapes of, of Martin Luther King cheating. Yep. Yes. They look up to her because they was like, this bitch stood in the gap, even though this man stepped out. Women get credit for that shit. <clears throat> Your grandmama get credit for it, especially yep. in the black community. Yep. What do we oh. talk about? It's all kind of bitches when granddaddy died, showed up with kids. <laughs> they talk about that all what the time, but mean? grandma held that shit down. She did. But she's also a Ain't nobody ever said granddaddy held that shit down. Grandma was out sucking dick, <laughs> but he stayed there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, what, what about you? you? Thoughts on the Me? show? Hmm? Yeah. Um, it was cool. I like hearing everybody's opinions, even though I might not have agreed. <laughs> I love oh my gosh. Saying opinions. Can I speak? We've been saying facts. You guys have been saying facts, opinions. opinions, whatever you want to call them. I All liked right. hearing them from everybody. All right, that's it. It was insightful. Thank you for coming. Thanks Did you learn anything? Having me. Um, yeah. What did What'd you learn? <laughs> Other than I ain't shit. Oh, true. Go! <laughs> Go! I didn't need that. <laughs> she quite no more. God damn. She been waiting to say that. Damn. She's been holding in. Yes! <laughs> nigga, nigga. Yo, out of here, bro, she ain't quiet. She loud as hell out wow. there. Wow. I bet. My feelings don't matter to you. Mm-hmm. What I did. Chocolate on chocolate crime. We <laughs> 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 finna see you tonight. <gasps> Who's Sing a moan, man. <laughs> All right, uh, what else? Okay, what about you? I'd say it's. Wait, it was very controversial. Did you answer the question? No. No, it, yeah. it was okay, though. Oh, yeah. so go ahead, finish, finish what you're saying. Go ahead. Oh, I was just going to say I learned how to talk into a microphone. That's <laughs> the takeaway? Mm hmm. <laughs> I'm not giving y'all. This is your first time props. doing this? Yeah. yeah. Yo, well, you did well. Thanks. Yo, you know the, the oh, singer. Oh, you're being nice. No, I'm. No, she actually did. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You know there's a singer in New York, right? Singer in New York? Yeah, singer in New York. Okay. With rainbow hair. Six nine. Yeah, you know his, his favorite phrase. No. Oh. You know this. Stupid. <laughs> really. All right, go ahead. Yo, y'all is it. All right. This was very controversial. Are you gonna get back with your guy? <laughs> Give him a chance. <laughs> I thought about it. Oh, don't I don't laugh. Should. I think this is something we can. Work. I think we can. I think you should get back with him. Yeah. No, I said some things. I you. said some things. Maybe you go home. You're 29, right? Little bit. 29. With two kids. With two kids. You're 29 with two kids. Yeah. And I appreciate and, you and, and you and you're gonna be divorced. Do you know how much harder it's gonna be for you to find a man at 29 with two kids? That's a provider. Take you serious? To take that's gonna actually take you seriously. Mm -hmm. It is. You don't know. Mm -hmm. Oh no. shit. We tell you right now it's gonna be hard. You can find a nigga that need a place to stay though. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 Uh, yeah. yeah. I'm uh, just being oh, serious. Let me let me give you the best advice you're gonna ever hear. It's going to be way harder for you to find a guy now than when you were 21, when you met your guy originally. Yep. Women, 29 you... with two kids, though? Yeah, it's not like just mm. three kids or four kids. That's a fuck no. That's, that's, that's still that's two. Two. No. two kids? It's going to be a no. Two kids. <laughs> yes, because a girl wouldn't And here's the other thing, too, just so y'all know. A guy if a dude got some money, kids. he got some status, why would he take a single mom with two kids when he can get a girl that's 21 with no kids? Hold True. on. Would you date a guy with two kids? Yeah. No, no, okay. If, yeah. if you had no kids. Um, Think about this, would you? If I had I no would. kids, I I really. He Think had a this. kid before when I met him. Women with kids is just I literally your kids. I became a stepmom at the age of twenty. Your kids is this man's sperm walking around. It just grew up. Yeah. <laughs> this nigga sperm just step out your womb and start walking around, and I gotta see this nigga fucking you every time I see your kid. That that's, that's what, what happens. That's what you think about. Ladies, the older you that's get, that's what that is, is it not? Yeah. Hold on. The older you get, and the more kids you have. The less value you have, I fucking said it. I've, I've heard that before. It's the truth. Mm -hmm. I don't want to raise it. nobody else's children. That is a horrible thing. What do lions do when they get a lioness that's got kids? What Eat do they them. do to it? Kill it. Kill yeah, they in oh. the animal kingdom they understand this ain't a natural thing. And they viciously kill the kids too. It's not no like a uh, you know painless. Death. It's but, like they fucking shake them up and fuck them up. And they make yeah. the bitch watch. Yep. And then they fuck them after. Yep. Yep. Yes. <laughs> Actually, matter of fact, the lioness is going to... dead ass. This is all animal planet. You don't believe me? You got heat. new new lion comes in. Kills all the cubs. The women go into heat. He has kids with, the, with yep. them. Yeah. So it's not natural Thank for a man you. to take care of children that aren't his. 
You have some guys out there that's willing to. No, you're just saying it's not that. Yeah, it's not. There's some guys take dick in the ass, too. They still ain't that. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know what kind of guys? You race, need to stop laughing at this race crap, kids. I'm sorry. <laughs> the type of men that race step kids are mm -hmm. not the men that you want. I'm telling you. Facts. Ooh. They're not attractive. It's They're not the man that you win. want. Yep. What? I was there. Men it's that nice. have options that yeah. are attractive, the men that you guys want, six foot plus, making 100,000, charming, charismatic, all this bullshit that you ladies think that you're entitled to. He's not putting up with stepkids, bro. Tell what me. makes him a go-getter makes him not go get you. Oh, oh shit. Oh, yo. 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 Find a provider or 29 with two kids. I'm, I'm telling you, bro, it's gonna be tough, man. Try to work it out. Just try to work it out, man. Try to work it out. Try to work it out. What about you? This dating game is tough. I actually was fucking with the podcast. Um, until usually I have long conversations with my dad like this, and you guys actually, yeah, and he actually thinks the same way you guys think that a man is a leader, and if he has a female, she has to fall in line oh, and okay. certain things. So it Isn't was, it crazy how all men think the same? We really do. We really are all the same. And we're very simple. Yeah, we're, we're not very simple. Have you ever noticed how complex women are simple, with the way that y'all yes, think? Yes. Aren't we? It's, it's in our nature. Thank you. And men nature also. Mm -hmm. So we're, we're like when people say, when women say they don't understand men, no, you're just a hard-headed bitch. <laughs> <laughs> is it not true? Men are quite point, simple yeah. to understand. It's just you want to complicate it. And even if you watch conversations with women, it's very simple when you're talking to a man. That shit get convoluted, as you've heard and you've seen because you did it yourself. It gets convoluted because I think women need this. We don't need it because we get it in the... When we walk out the door, there is conflict and confrontation almost everything we do. We don't want it from you. You don't have that. You walk out and this nigga's whistling, telling you you got a fat ass and one holler. <laughs> yeah, we live life on easy money. Yeah, man. so you want what it is that we are trying to avoid. Wait, she got asked? Bro, absolutely. <laughs> okay, anyhow, um, get it. Yeah, party. Yeah, niggas. Everpod.org, link is down there, guys. Yeah, party's tomorrow. We're going to be leaving for Fort Lauderdale tomorrow at around 9.30.